In this video, we will show you how to track calls using property listing as an example. There are a few steps to get started. To buy a number, click on the plus order numbers button. Let's select a country. Then choose a city. Let's pick Las Vegas. Now click on plus add to basket. Review the details and click on place order. Call rules need to be applied in order for your iOvox numbers to receive calls. First, create a call rule by going to the call rules page and clicking on plus call rule. There are a few options possible. Let's try forward to an individual. Let's call it whisper to receiver, call recording and auto transcribe. Select a country and type in the phone number. If you have your contacts synced to your account, you can also click on select contact. Let's try the advanced options. Let's add a whisper for the receiver. If it has not been created yet, click on the Create Whisper button. You can also record calls to listen to and transcribe the calls. We want the Auto Transcribe option so that all calls are transcribed. Click on Save. The item is the identity of the iOvox number. It provides an extra layer of information with name, ID, and tags. And this is also what the call rules will be assigned to. To create a new item, go to the Items page. Click on Plus Item. Let's call it Google AdWords. Let's add ABC234 as the ID. Tags appear in the analytics. For instance, GA lead. By default, the item is added to the default group. Let's select Web Marketing Campaign. Let's pick Whisper to Receiver, Call Recording and Auto Transcribe. Let's choose our Las Vegas number. Once items have been created, they are all available from the Items page. It is also possible to apply an item from the iVox Numbers page. To do so, go to the iVox Numbers page. On the left part of the page, select an iVox number. From the side menu, select the item using the drop-down menu. You can also apply a call rule. An item must first be applied to do so. Now we would like to track callers that want a viewing. Go to the keyword spotting section and click on plus keyword rule. Choose a name for your keyword rule. Select caller, receiver or speakers for both ends of the phone call. Type what you would like us to spot. Let's enter interested, time and view with an asterisk at the end. This will catch words like viewed, viewing, etc. Other special characters can be added for advanced keyword spotting. Check out our help articles for the details. Let's select match any. We'll put viewing booked here. Now you're all set. Calls are going through and call details will appear in your account. Let's review. Our number is now assigned to an item that belongs to a group. The call rule applied will allow us to check call recordings, transcriptions and keywords. You now need to copy the iVox number and place it in an online ad on a website or for a listing, etc. Now let's go to the Insights section. Click on the KPI boxes to display different graphs. Let's have a closer look at the calls in the table. I'm interested in this specific call. 
This is a call from our web campaign and it looks like the caller wants to book a viewing. Great! Click on view and trigger the call details with the side menu on the right. Click on view full transcription. The keywords will appear on top of the transcription. Click on them to highlight them inside the text. Click on the download icon to get a PDF version of the transcription with the keywords highlighted. You can export either standard CSV or keyword triggered CSV depending on the information that you're looking for.